Hello, welcome to tutorialwebdesign.com. Today we are going to learn how to create a sale banner for an e-commerce website. So today our subject is footwear. So in this tutorial you will learn how to create a sale banner for an for an e-commerce website and for that particular sections where you want to highlight uh, footwear selling thing. Uh, this footwear are up to 50% off or a 60% off or a 70% off or whatever the amount is. So here first of all let's resize the image. Yes, I am resizing it. Change the color combinations. Control my uh, pressing control plus L. Level it. I mean here I am highlighting the shoe okay because we are creating the banner for shoe here is the text copy all the text footwear for men copying it press con paste it here setting the font size here yeah okay uh, see I like the main term footwear. You can choose uh, any font, whatever you want. Okay. So, see, in my image, footwear in black is clearly visible, and uh, I am highlighting that uh, with text also footwear. Now, it is clearly with the banner that I mean, uh, we are going to create a banner for uh, footwear, and this banner will display on the e commerce website. Okay, now what are the what are the offers? Uh, I mean, uh, we are giving to footwear uh, in the footwear banner. We are writing here one punchline to describe. Get refreshing support with no range of footwear. Okay, this is just one punchline to attract user okay get refreshing support you can write anything whatever you want but i am writing this line here so get refreshing support with new range of footwear set the font size first uh, uh, alphabet of uh, every text you can make it in caps that's not necessary Okay, new range of footwear. So new range, basically new range. So that's why I have I have converted the first alphabet of uh, new to uppercase, and of uh, F of footwear. Okay, new range of footwear. The font size of this punchline will be slightly, uh, I mean, uh, smaller than the uh, main main text that footwear. Footwear will be in bold. This will be in normal. Now see, the text is casual, shoes, formal shoes and I mean we are, uh, we will write here the type of footwear we are uh, going to sell on sale, okay, we will mention here. So what I am doing is, I am making it more clear, footwear for men, no, footwear for men, earlier it was footwear, it was not clear that uh, it was footwear for women, footwear for men, footwear for girls, footwear for boys. I am making it more clear. Footwear for men. Set the font size again. Uh, set the font size little bit smaller than the main text. Okay. Footwear for men is clearly visible now. Get refreshing support with new range of footwear is also clearly visible. Increase the font size of uh, footwear word little bit more than uh, that uh, for men. Type the text. Get refreshing support with new range of footwear. Copy it. Change the text with now we will display here the discount up to 50% off this is the main deal for which user uh, will come on the website and see the deal increase the font size of up to 50% off set the margin I 
I am changing here again. Instead of writing any punch lines, just make it more clear by typing what type of footwear we are going to sell. It can be casual, formal, sports, sandals, flip flops, and premium shoes. Now you are seeing that our banner is clearly, I mean, uh, more visible. Footwear for men, and what type of footwear we are going to sell. Display the types of footwear and then offer up to 50% off. These are the three main elements. Align all these three elements in center, fit it in particular width. Highlight 50% off little bit by adding one line on top and one line bottom. See in this banner two things are clear, footwear for men up to 50% off. Types you can give, types you cannot give, that's not necessary. You can add punchline instead of uh, writing the types. Okay, but punchline and discount is necessary. See user comes on the e-commerce website particularly for deals. If deal is not there. He will not click on the banner. Okay, so we are showing here the deal. Footwear for men up to 50% off. That is sufficient. Now call to action. Call to action should be one. We cannot confuse the user by uh, displaying two buttons. So there should be only one button on the banner. Click here. Show deal. View now, you can write anything on this button. Okay. So I will click, I will write here, click here. Right click here, make it white and uh, at the center of this button. So now we will align all these four elements according to our requirement. So see, I am doing something, some changes in this manner. Something, I mean, little upward, something downward, something left, something right. Elements should not appear uh, on the footwear image. So for this, uh, uh, you can resize some text, you can change the font of some font size of some text, make it a little bit upwards. Now some do some decoration. I am cutting some part of from this uh, footwear image and will place see what I am doing I have just cut some portion from this image and adding it on the uh, in the footwear text very simple you can Check it again what I have done. For more tutorials you can subscribe to our channel. Give some shadow effect to the text. See, all comes uh, with practice. Okay. 
do this do that so footwear for men up to 50% off and click here these three are main elements casual formal sandals flip flops premium you can show it here or you can not show it here. that's not an issue this is extra element I am adding some, you know, effect in this banner. Don't forget to subscribe our channel. See, this is the final banner. Thanks a lot. Don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you very much.